This whole thing was overflowing. This is it right here. It has my little cards that I wrote a message on. These are the lanyards. I had eight of them made. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like fun. channel today's video I'm going to be just getting ready for the next market that I'm doing you guys have been liking to see these videos where I get ready for the market and get all set up and everything so I have a market coming up this weekend and I decided to do another video and this market is actually a festival so it's gonna be really busy and I have a lot of stuff to get prepared last weekend wasn't too busy so I do have quite a good stock right now but the first thing that I'm working on stocking back up are my keychains and my wristlets. And I will show you um, how I make those right now. They're macrame and I have all my cord over here that I'm going to get cutting right now. All I need is my clipboard, my ruler, and my scissors. And then I have my cord over here in a bin. I'm in my sunroom right now because it's brighter in here to film. So I moved my stuff out from my closet because it would not have been good in there. And also my closet's a disaster. So we're gonna pretend that everything's clean in here and get to work. And then the other things that I have lined up that are on my to-do list are Play-Doh kits. I need to make about 18 more Play-Doh kits because I make them in batches of six. And then I also need to make more bracelets. I talked about that at the end of my last video. I just finished filming that one. And I decided to start this one right away because now I'm working on prepping for next weekend. But yeah, I'm gonna get those started. And then I also have to make lanyards and a couple more things. Mama, What's going on? I want on? a different snack. You want a different snack? Mm -hmm. Do you want to say hi to the vlog? Hi vlog. Tell them what day it is. It's Father's Day. <laughs> Can you say Happy Father's Day? Happy Father's Day, Daddy. I just love my daddy. You do? Mm -hmm. He's the best dad. Yeah, he's so sweet to me. That's so nice. And I love Santa too. You love Santa? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my goodness. He gives me lots of lots of good presents I like. He does? Mm -hmm. Who's Santa? Who gets you the presents? Mama and Daddy. <laughs> Are you just pretending? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, you're funny. Santa is Ella's papa. <laughs> Yeah, you're right. Was he dressed up like Santa last year? Yeah. So here I have my notebook with all the keychains and all the wristlets I need to make wrote down. And it's actually not that many. It won't take me long. And I have my clipboard to hold my keychains while I'm making them and my ruler to measure out the cord right now. And then I have all my colors of cord in here. I love looking at all my colors. I kind of want to get a few more, but I'm just waiting for the right time. So it might be a little while to let you some more colors and I need to get some more of some of my more popular ones like this one's kind of running low but I've had these colors for I think over a year now and they last forever like some of them I barely use because I don't make a ton of that color because they don't sell as much but some of them like this one is getting low this one's getting low but yeah I'm gonna measure out my cord right now and start making the ones that I need to make and I forgot to show my little basket here. I have all my keychain clasps in them and my scissors and I'm about ready to start. Yeah. Here's to the good days, here's to the sorrows. If this is a mistake, I know about tomorrow. I don't wanna fight no more cause I don't feel the need no more, no. Just wanna make it stop Maybe it's something in the water Or maybe we just hit the end of the road Right now it doesn't even matter It's too late not to let it go And that's why I Wish you the best to say goodbye You start to get dressed and then Just this does. We 
had a good run Don't say we didn't I was your first love And you were my first one Cheers to all the memories The venom and the remedies, yeah Promise I won't forget, yeah Maybe it's something in the water Or maybe we just hit the end of the road Right now it doesn't even matter It's too late not to let it go And that's why I wish you the best to say goodbye You start to get dressed and then My camera ran out of storage as I was filming me doing all these keychains and I didn't notice until I was almost done. But I've got all my keychains tied onto the little clasps right now. And then now I can just sit down and make all of these. I can probably make these in one day and then like cut and brush them all too. I have to brush the ends of them out. I only have to make seven wristlets so that won't take me long. I can do that tomorrow. And then I'll be moving on to lanyards tomorrow too. And I'll show you guys the lanyards once I get to those. The wristlets, I didn't tie the wristlets yet because I want to get these accomplished first. I don't want to have too much lined up to do. So I'll just do these first. It's the next day, it's Monday today, and I am doing some orders right now. So I'm gonna show you what I'm doing. And also I've been prepping stuff for the market today. I got all of my lanyards made. I'm gonna show you those right now. I'm really excited that I made those today. And then also I made the rest of my keychains and and then I think I'm good on my wristlets. Now that I looked at it again, it doesn't really seem like I need to make anymore. So now all I have to do are my Play-Doh kits and my bracelets. I think I have to make like 30 bracelets and then 20 or 18 Play-Doh kits. So that is all I have left to do. And I have now until Friday to do that. So I have a long time. So it's looking like I'm set on that, but that's not all I have to do this week. I also will have to do orders as they come in. I have, I think, about 10 orders right now to send out, so that's what I'm doing. And I also have a new little packaging stand that I'm going to show you. This is it right here. It has my little cards that I write a message on, my stickers, these cards that I put in the package, or if it's a bracelet, then I put it in these little bracelet bags with the card in them, and then my thank you cards. I need to get some more of these thank you cards ordered because... I'm running low on these, and I like to hand them out at the market too. So I have those, and this is the perfect little packaging basket. All I need to get out are my mailers. So I will do that, and then I'm gonna get these Etsy packages mailed out, and I have a few from Instagram, and they're all made right here. I think I have like seven sets left to make. Um, I don't have those slips printed out. I'll print those out after I make the orders, but yeah, that's what we got going on. And then these are all the keychains I finished up today. Yesterday I made most of them and then today I tied them all off and cut them and made a few more. And lastly, these are the lanyards. I had eight of them made from the last market that were left over and then I think I made like 15 today. If you're counting them right now, I might have done my math wrong. I might have made like 12 or 13. But aren't they so pretty? I just love the colors of them. So that is what I have. These don't sell very fast at the market. I usually only sell like, I just got my new display board made and I sold I think like five last time. So these will last um, for this weekend coming up, which is a festival. And then also for the 4th of July, I would think. I don't think they'll sell out. I probably won't have to make any more for a while, but yeah. That is a big accomplishment that I can check off of my list. It's Friday morning and I'm leaving tonight to go up to the cottage so that I'll be there for the farmer's market tomorrow. I'm gonna show you guys everything that I have packed up right now. And I have 40 Play-Doh kits that I finished making. I think I had like 12 left over from the last market and then I ended up making 32. I actually might have a few more than 40 because I think I made 32 and then I had 12 left over. So I might have, um, like 44 so we'll see but I have a ton and I'm not gonna set them all out probably I'll probably just um, bring more out as they they get sold but I'm gonna show you guys everything right now my kids are having a picnic on the deck I'm about to join them so this is everything that I have packed and I still have my boards with all the keychains on them and lanyards and then a couple bags don't mind this this is just a pair of jeans that I threw on top of here with the book that I'm reading and this whole thing is filled with Play-Doh kits, like I was saying. And then there's also a bunch more. There's like a big layer in this bag. 
And I am using all my new bags. I'm not using cardboard boxes this time, which I'm really excited about. So I won't look like I'm homeless now. But yeah, everything's ready to go. We're dog sitting right now for Drew's parents. So we have their dog. And how's your picnic, kids? Good. Good. Is it good? Good. What are you eating? Grape. Grape. Grapes? What else? Nuggets. Chicken nuggets and fries? Fine. They're having chicken nuggets and fries. We just made them in the air fryer. I'm great. And how does it feel out there? Is it warm? Mm -hmm. This is what I have left to pack up. I just have my boards which are going to go in the car. And then I was actually going to show you something else. I'm doing a fun giveaway with a couple friends um, from the market. They both have shops too. And we're all going to throw in stuff together. I'm going to add these two little clips this notepad, this set of bracelets right here, which is one of my favorites, and then a uh, wristlet. I'm not sure if I'm gonna add this lanyard yet because the other girl might have something similar, so I might take this out, but I'm adding all of these things, and then there's gonna be some earrings, some keychains coming in, because they make some really fun stuff. So we're gonna do a big giveaway, and I'm really excited for that. I also have my bead baskets packed up here with all the beads in them to make custom bracelets at the market. And I don't know why I'm bringing this many beads. I could have narrowed it down, but I never like to be missing a color if someone asks for something specific. So I'm just gonna bring both of them. And I need to get cleaning up because the house was clean this morning and now it's kind of in disarray. My kitchen is still at least clean and my living room is decent. I have to hide the blankets though because the dog likes to try to lay on them and I don't really love animals, so I put them away. Welcome back. Hello. What? Hello back. Hello, welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm back from the market, as you can see. And I haven't got ready yet today. Puppy, it's Sunday morning. Puppy, puppy. That's not a puppy. That's a clip. And I'm just looking through my market stuff. I'm going to show you guys what I sold. I ended up selling about $1,000 worth. So that was better than last time. Last time, I think I sold like $750. And this was a festival, so it was pretty good. It wasn't as busy as everyone thought it was going to be. They said that next week's going to be extremely busy. So I've been ordering stuff. Don't mind that the bed's not made in the background. But Jet is playing with my clips here. I need to get these put away. This is my clip basket. Clip basket. What? Clip basket. Yes, this is my clip basket. And it has all my clips. No, I no, sold a lot no. of clips at the market. This whole thing was overflowing, and then also when it started to empty out, I filled it up again. So I puppy, sold a lot of clips, puppy, and I just ordered puppy, a ton more. Puppy. 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 Oh, my goodness. Puppy. And I'm going to show you guys in the next video when those come in. I'll show you what I ordered, just like I did in this video. Ba, 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 deep, and, we will. <laughs> and there's a little song from Jet. So yeah, my clips are one of my most popular things, I would say. They're, they're not the thing that makes me the most money by any means, but they're really popular and it gets people looking. And my bracelets are my most popular item, which is good for me because I really wanted my bracelets to be the main focal point of my setup. So that's really good. And then it draws people to order online too. So this is my size extra smalls. I just moved over my bracelets like I did last time to see how many I need to make. So I think I need to make about 10 bracelets fly, that are extra fly, small. Fly. Butterfly. Butterfly. Yeah. Fly. So I need to make about five or six more mediums. Larges are okay. Large is probably my least popular size at the market. And if anyone needs a large and they don't have the one that they want, I can always make it for them right on the spot there. That's my most popular thing is making bracelets on the spot with kids' names on them or adults' names or their children's names. I make all the bracelets at the market. 
um, while people are looking and ordering. It gets a little tricky because I have to hurry when I'm making them, but it's really fun. And then this is the size smalls. I moved all my bracelets over and it looks like I need to make about 10, I might make about 15 or 20 smalls so I can have a few extras once the racks start to empty because it's the 4th of July weekend, so it's gonna be really busy. So yeah, I have some work to do, but I have plenty of Play-Doh kits. I don't have to make any Play-Doh kits. And my lanyards, I still have plenty of lanyards left. I probably sold about five this time, but I just took them down so they didn't fall in my car. In my keychains and wristlets, I have plenty too. I probably only need to make like 10 wristlets to fill my board back up because I had quite a few left over, which I was actually happy about because I didn't want to have to restock completely for the 4th of July. My sister's coming today. We haven't seen her in like six months, so we're going to spend Hello. a lot of time with her this week. Hello. 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 So that was actually good that my boards didn't empty out too much. And my keychains should be good. I might need to make like three keychains, but I like to just have three of every color. And it's looking pretty full. So that is that. And this is what I was talking about for the Play-Doh kits. I only sold like, I think five, maybe five or six. It was probably because I tried to raise my prices to $10 for these. I am I lowered them back to eight about halfway through or about, it was probably more than halfway through. And also they were all starting to have condensation in them because it was so hot out. So when I got home, I emptied them all out and wiped them down, put the Play-Doh back in, and they're all perfectly fine. The pink, the dye started to like melt out of it a little bit, so now it's like a tie-dye pink, but that's okay, I guess. I squished all of them, and they're all super squishy. None of them dried out or anything in the heat, and I wiped all of the condensation out, so they're all back to normal, and I don't have to make any more for this time. I was getting really worried because I thought I was going to have to remake them all. I made 4th of July ones. And I might have to bring a cooler this time to put them in because, yeah, the heat wasn't really working out for the Play-Doh. So that's that. This was my sample one I had set up. So I'll probably have to do another sample one this time so people can see. But yeah, this whole bin is full. And I probably have like 35 Play-Doh kits to bring for the weekend, which is plenty. So that's going to be all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure and give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. What? I saw the vlog on my toys. You want to show the vlog all your toys? Where? We watch the sun go down. Hey, show them. Wow, it's messy in here. Messy in here. Okay, say bye, vlog. Good job.